marriage is a commitment to life where two people can find and bring out the very best in each other. It offers opportunities for sharing and growth that no other human relationship can equal. A physical and emotional joining that has the promise of a lifetime. here or as I would say that time is right I can't even explain how much I love you I love you more than anything in the world you're my best friend my other half and one day my mother and my kids there's nothing more in this world I could ever ask for than you I have given the best gift anyone can ever receive in life which is you um, no matter how bad my day is once I see you my day becomes amazing if I'm mad about my day or upset you always know how to cheer me up you truly make me the happiest person in the world. Today's. Today starts the future of us being one. And I couldn't be more excited about that. Let's have the most amazing day of our lives together today and really enjoy every moment of today. I love you so much and I can't wait to truly call you Mrs. Pulaski. Zach and Tara both mentioned their vows. You know, they uh, they met during on the dodgeball dodgeball court when Zach threw a dodgeball at Tara, and then the relationship grew when Zach asked Tara to play on his kickball team. So I, I know what everyone's thinking right now. What a cute story, right? They met 20 some years ago in elementary school gym class, but no, no, it, it was a few years ago because. As Zach and Tara head into their 30s, they're still playing dodgeball and kickball.
I know I don't show my emotions often, but I would like to say thank you for a couple things. Always being there for me when I need you, whether I'm sad, upset, or mad, you always know what to do. Putting up with me when the Eagles game is on and I don't fully listen. Saying yes to marrying me because we all know that's a hard decision. And staying with me after I dance to one of my favorite thongs, songs, the thong song. Because that's embarrassing. And last but not least, for being my best friend and now my wife. I promise to love you forever, always be there for you when you need me, and to tell you at least once a day that I love you. Love can be bad, bad love, bad, very bad love. Love makes messes. Love leaves you little surprises here and there. Love needs lots of cleaning up after. Sometimes you just want to get love fixed. Sometimes you want to roll up a piece of newspaper and swat love on the nose. Not so much to cause pain, just to let love know, don't you ever do that again. Sometimes love just wants to go out for a nice long walk because love's exercise. It will run you around the block and leave you panting and breathless, pull you in different directions at once, or wind itself around you and around you until you're all wound up and you can't move. But love makes you meet people wherever you go, people who have nothing in common but love. Stop and talk to each other on the street. Throw things away and love will bring them back again and again and again. But most of all, love needs love, lots of it. And in return, love loves you and never stops. you both nothing but happiness in the years to come and we love you both so much and we're looking forward to a lifetime of memories the occasional fights and with a side of dominoes <laughs> so everyone <laughs> please, please raise, raise your glasses, glasses to the couple of the decade zach, zach and sarah, sarah. <laughs> with your passion, devotion, and spontaneous personality. I love us and who we become together, the laughter and the friendship that we share. We have found love and trust in each other and became true soulmates. My love for you grows stronger each day, and to think this journey all started with a simple dodgeball to the face. Besides, the promise I am going to make to you today, I want you to know how lucky I am to have someone who makes me feel the way you do, and to continue to try as hard as I can to make you feel as special as you make me feel. Now we are ready to begin the introductions. Let's start with parents of the bride, Dave and Gail Crocker. Coming in next, parents of the groom, John and Cindy Belosky. And here come Flower Girls, Cora and Jaden, and Ring Bearer Ryan. The mountain top, walk on water, I got power, feel so royal. One second, I'ma strike for you. Diamond platinum, no more for you. That adrenaline, never giving in. Giving up's not 
got an option, gotta get it in. Witness, I got the heart of 20 men. No deal, go to sleep in the lion's den. Now let's bring in the wedding party. First up, Nakina Flynn and Elliot Turfinko. Next up, Asha Bellis and Tyler Belosky. They are followed by Jessica Fritz and Mike Begany. Here for Maid of Honor, Brittany Hine and groomsman Sean Botts. And next up, Maid of Honor, Carly Hoskins and best man Steve Selprig. Bring them out, bring them out, bring them out. It's hard to yell when Let's the put those hands together away. and make some noise, out, Mr. and out, Mrs. Belosky. always see and encourage the best in one another. May the challenges that life offers you make your marriage even stronger. And may you always be each other's best friend and greatest love.
is with great joy that I am now able to pronounce that they are husband and wife, and I invite you to seal your vows with a kiss.